In this video, I'm going to show you how to transfer your own samples onto the sampler. First, you're going to need a SCSI card. I bought this one on eBay for about six euro. I installed this onto an XP system. The good thing about this card, no drivers required. Pre-installed an XP. I also need a SCSI cable, a 50 pin to 25 pin. Connecting the sampler to the computer is pretty straightforward. To convert wave samples to Aki format, I used a program called A-Wave Studio. First go to File, then Open File and load your samples into A-Wave. The samples I'm going to convert here are some closed hi-hats. Select all samples, then under Tools, Create Instrument Wizard. This window should pop up. Select a drum kit instrument, give it a name, and then select the two boxes underneath, and click Finish. Now under Root, you can see that each sample is assigned to a different note. Right click on the instrument created and save instrument. I have created a couple of folders to save the instrument in. Make sure to select Aki format when saving the samples. Next we need to see if the cards installed correctly. First go to my computer, right click and select properties. Under device manager select disk drives. You can now clearly see that the four virtual drives created on the SCSI to SD card can now be seen. To transfer the samples onto the Aki sampler, I'm going to use a program called Chicken Systems Translator 2.9. This only works on XP. We can now see the four virtual drives inside Chicken's Systems Translator. You can also see the samples I converted in a folder below. Select this folder in the Object List window. Drag the program instrument, in this case it's the CHH program, onto any of the virtual hard drives partitions. The sample should now be transferred onto the sampler.